<laughs> okay. A couple years ago, my family lost everything. The barrels went from the penthouse to the street overnight. I was forced to drop out of school, and now I'm here, edging my way into an entry-level job with Conrad Grayson. And I imagine your chances for landing that job would take a nosedive if Conrad knew about your past. All right, Nolan. You got me. But tell me, who gets you? Excuse me? You'd think there'd be people crawling all over you. But here you are, all alone. Now then, I can't have you sharing all this. You did say this was a negotiation, so let's make a deal. One bloody rose. Pathetic. It was just a dinner. Not to me. Ever since I got here, all I've wanted is to be a player in the scenes, not lurking behind them. So the whole loyal employee thing is just an act? My loyalties lie with Ashley. I'm here to make a name for myself. I don't get to sit on my ass and watch my inheritance grow like every other spoiled 20-something around here, yourself included. Ash, uh, you've got me all wrong. My father's company is bankrupt, and my family's been dealing with massive debt. I'm their only hope in rebuilding. And why didn't you just tell me that? Because I was afraid you'd tell them. I mean, you see how these people are? They smell blood in the water, and you're as good as dead. That still doesn't explain why you stood me up. I went to Conrad's office in the city tonight, and I made copies of his confidential database. This time next year, he won't make a single decision without consulting me. I'll be indispensable. Wow. Ambitious. You're more alike than I thought. Tyler never showed up for dinner. I'm impressed. How'd you do it? <laughs> well, I can't take all the credit. I took a page from the Angel of Revenge herself. Dug up some dirt, used it for leverage. What's the dirt? Suffice it to say, our boy is a bit of a con man. But he doesn't know that you can't con a con. Emily? Whatever you're doing, keep it up. Oh, I plan to. Sleep tight.